What's up guys, this is Xtro here and today we are hacking on some high pixel 4v4 v4 v4 I think v4 uh, Bed Wars is brand new game audio has been saying me for me to continue uh, playing on this So here we are today, but the main topic of discussion here in this video is the fact that my server actually is now up and is semi somewhat moving in the correct direction now a lot of you guys gave me some feedback and said that you do not want just a completely bland and creative server so we decided we're not doing that at all but I will say the Bycraft right now if you want to join right now uh, the buy the Bycraft the link will be in the top description if you guys want to go over there and check it out see if you want to buy a whitelist or whatever there is also going to be a rank added to that Bycraft either um, either later on today or it's already up in the store so if you buy a whitelist uh, and you want to buy a rank as well you can uh, which brings me to my next point of what this server is actually going to be because now we kind of have it figured out. We don't have everything figured out, I will tell you that much. Everything's still kind of in the works, but the main thing is hacking is going to be allowed, yes, to a certain extent. What does that mean? Some hacks are going to be uh, not allowed, obviously, as you guys can just clearly tell. We're not going to allow you just to fly around the entire map, okay? That's not going to be allowed at all. Some hacks are, uh, most hacks are going to be allowed, some are not. Uh, right now, the only way to get on the server is a whitelist, but the main concept of it is there's going to be a lot of twists going into it. It's going to be a very unique HCF server. And I don't know how this is going to go over with some of you, with you guys. I don't know if you guys are going to like it or if you guys are going to hate it. But for right now, the only game mode we're going to have is a customized and unique HCF. Um, and it's pretty, honestly, I mean, I hate to sound selfish, but it's pretty much going to be exactly how I'm picturing it in my head and how I want it. So, I mean... That sounds selfish and bad, but that's literally what it's going to be. Like, it's going to be how I'm picturing it um, at the start. And then, obviously, if things need to be changed, they will. Uh, I, I wonder if Antibot works now. Because I was actually just streaming a little bit ago, and Antibot was not working. Let's check it out here, though. Um, so, yeah, it's going to be an HCF. Oh, it does. Um, it is going to be an HCF server uh, where hacks are going to be allowed, and there's going to be a lot of unique and kind of cool things, in my personal opinion. So, hopefully, you guys enjoyed as well. I listened to you guys. Um, I listened to all your guys' comments on all my videos, and a lot of you guys said there's no point in doing just a creative. Uh, server we don't want that so we're not doing that you guys now have a game mode to start off with I definitely do think I want to do more game modes on the server but to launch uh, it is going to be the HCF right now like I said it is only whitelist the only way you can join is if you buy a whitelist a whitelist um, is on the Bycraft like I said Ooh, somebody just gave us sharpness on our swords thank you very much teammate um, so that's that uh, like I said, the rank the, the rank will either be in the store right now, or and it's the first rank ever, and it's going to be a limited rank. So if you're interested, uh, if once you buy the whitelist, if you're interested in buying a rank that's going to be very, very limited, uh, then I would suggest doing that as well. It's going to give you some pretty nice perks, too, for HCF. If you're a big HCF player, you would know. Um, so HCF, if you don't know what it is, you can look up videos of it and stuff like that. But it's basically where if like you die, it's pretty much like it's it's hardcore factions. So if you die, you uh, you are death banned for a certain time. Um, but ranks and stuff like that will all help out in that. But I also think I want to do some sort of like one v one or two v two arena as well later on down the road. But I will say we are going to open the server with HCF like. Because like I said, the server is not going to be whitelisted forever. The whitelist is only for the people that want to join now. Um, the server will be open. We are going to open it with HCF only. So when we do choose to make it go public and we get everything sorted out and the bug fix is gone and everything, then... Um, and then what basically then we're going to open it and then everybody can join and then eventually we will have other game modes and stuff like that and the people that buy a whitelist are going to have a lot uh, you know a lot of different access uh, for example they might even have a beta access to if like say we start a 1v1 arena or a 2v2 arena or whatever the case may be um, the white the, well, the people that bought the whitelist in the beginning are going to have priority access or like beta access into playing that and getting the bugs out for that before it's released to the entire server. So I would definitely uh, if you if you want to I would definitely say go and buy a whitelist. 
Um, you don't have to by at all means if you don't want to. If you don't want to, if you don't want, if you hate the idea of the server, then you don't have to buy it. If you don't want to buy one in general, if you don't have enough money, whatever the case is, save your money. I don't really. It's up to you 100% what you want to do. I'm not forcing you to buy a whitelist. The server will be open. I think that's the big thing that people need to get through their head is the server will be open. Just right now, it's for the people that don't want to wait and they just want to join right now. So that's why that whitelist is there. So. I think that's about done of what I've said. I've said a lot in the beginning of this video already. Uh, if you're still watching this video, let me uh, actually, no, it's not, it's, we're not even that deep in the recording, but uh, just do me a favor, go down, like the video for this, because uh, I'm finally talking to you guys about the server. We've kind of figured it out now, exactly what we want. Uh, so yeah, it's going to be an HCF server where hacks are allowed, like I said, uh, but it's going to be a very unique and customized HCF, but it's not going to be like overly topped unique and customized it's just going to be some things are going to be different but like it's still going to be hcf that you all like uh or i mean i know some people are going to absolutely hate the idea of an hcf server but like i said we can always expand into more game modes and stuff like that um so yeah anyway thank you guys so much for watching this video i don't know why i just tried out out my video we're doing a whole another game of bed wars Man, there's just way too much going on in my brain right now, but we're going to go play another game of Bed Wars. We're not ending the game. We're not ending this video after, after one game. So we'll see you guys in just a second. Alrighty. Second game, last game of this video. My phone is just going bonkers over there. I don't know. I was trying to find a cool word to say right there, and I kind of didn't succeed in doing it right away. So it kind of took me a little bit. Uh, let us get some uh, blocks here. I don't know how we're still getting gold, even though we're not even near it, but that's okay. Let's get a weapon, and we are just going to rush. This game is going to be fully about rushing. I want a ton of blocks. We're not even going to worry about getting iron armor. We're just going to go out there. We're going to scaffold the people's islands, and here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Hopefully you guys are enjoying this video. Like I said, we're using Flux Build 4 because we're getting the hype ready for Flux Build 5. If you guys didn't know, Build 5, I made a video on it. It's coming out very, very soon, and you guys are probably all going to enjoy it. Is this guy literally going to sit here and wait for me, or is he actually going to come and get me? There we go. We're good now. Come here, bud. Dude, he's lost. He's confused. They have no they have no defense at all. It doesn't matter, though, because I would kill it anyway. I would kill their bed anyway. Oh, it's over for him. I don't know what this guy thinks he's doing. Green is going to be eliminated. Green is eliminated. What? They have one person left. It's over here. Oh, he must have respawned like a little sneaky person there. Must have respawned. That's okay, though. I'm pro if he keeps running, then I'm probably just going to go straight to uh, yellow. Dude, where is this guy going, bro? Okay, we'll, we'll leave you alone. I'm going to go get rid of yellow's bed so in case any of them die, they can't respawn. Because that's the main part. You know, obviously, you, you know, you don't want him to respawn. Uh, he might respawn that one guy I just killed. But I want to get these resources beforehand. I don't think I have... Oh, no, I do have no slowdown on. Okay, interesting. So, no more yellow are going to spawn. There's one more yellow. Green is completely out of it. And now I have to go over and get red's bed. Which they made a nice little path for me here. And they also do not have a defense set up in their bed. Because it's very early on in the game. Like I said, if you just rush early on... Um, I mean, you have to have some PvP skill. Because you can't just do what I'm doing. You can't just use kill or unless if you hack. But... Um, if you go early on, they're going to have no defenses or anything, so it's going to be very, very... Oh my god, look at the amount of gold I have, bro. Whew! That is a lot, a lot of gold right there. No lie at all. That, I don't even know what to do with all that gold, literally. I don't even know what to buy, because uh, really, there's only one more person left, and he's right here, and he just chucked my teammate off the map, so that means I'm going to have to come and get revenge on him. Oh boy, come here, bird. Come here, bud. Oh, you're dead. Good game. Oh, my bed was destroyed, too. That was a nice little 1v1 to end off this video. Anyway, that is going to wrap up this video this time. Man, I cannot talk right now because I'm talking way too fast. But anyway, like I said, if you guys want to buy the whitelist or the rank on the server, uh, the buy craft will be down in the description. Uh, thank you guys for anyone that's going to support it. I appreciate it. Uh, and yeah, hopefully you do enjoy the server. Um, I don't really have an edda of when it's going to be... 100% um, done and open to the public, but I will say if you buy a whitelist, you can expect a lot of changes to be happening in the coming weeks, and not in the coming weeks, but in the next like one or two weeks, and you can also expect downtime of the server. The server is not going to 100% be up. You can expect resets to your player, so in case you get stuff, uh, you can expect resets, bug fixes, game-changing bug fixes, game-changing things, stuff like that. So 
It's not going to be perfect. Like I said, the server's going to be down. If the server's down, you're just going to have to wait for it to go back up. Um, stuff like that. So, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you guys have enjoyed, please leave a like. And like I said, if you guys want to support the server early, uh, you can get the rank or the whitelist if you need to. But don't feel like you have to because, like I said, the server will be open to the public uh, eventually. I think this guy is flying. Oh, no, he has MVP, so he's allowed to because he has that little slash fly command. Hey, look, I can fly too, bro. I can fly too, bro. Whee! Anyway, peace.